What is it that will make it worth it for you? To face the rejections, the brainstorm and not be intimidated and say, I can do this. What is it that will make it worth it for you to raise the bar on yourself and say, I've got some more stuff in me. What is it that will make it worth it for you to make know your vitamin that you become empowered by it? What is it that will make it for you when you want to give up and things are working against you? What is it that will help you get back up again? Most people's dreams can be bought. With enough failure, with enough rejection, they will sell their dreams. They can't still fight. They can get a little bit, but when it gets a little too hot, they go, boom, so buy the dream. You can have it. It's not worth it to me. And their will to win is viable. You can buy it, but if you decide my will cannot be bought, I don't care how long it takes, you can't buy this dude out. I'll keep fighting for my family. I'm the one. I'm gonna change my family tree forever. That's the decision. Decide now. You're gonna keep negotiating the price or can you not be bought? Don't give up on yourself. Don't throw a towel in so quickly. Many people give up on the one yard line. You know the human spirit is powerful? There's nothing as powerful. It's hard to kill the human spirit. There's greatness in you. And you've got to learn how to tune out the critics outside and the critic inside. And since I'm going to do this, I'm going to harness my will. And I'm not going to let anything stop me. I deserve this. Working on yourself, talking to yourself. That's so very important. Overcoming the negative conversation that El dialogue is going on all the time. You've got to stand up inside yourself sometimes and say, shut up. I'm in control here. You've got to have an uplifted expression. Watch your body posture. All of these things affect you psychically. Start working and developing yourself now and prepare yourself for what it is that you want because you expect to get it. I don't want to be that person that's great when everything is going on good, but when something goes wrong, they flee and they want nothing to do with it. I want to be that person that's going to show up rain, sleet, or snow, and they're going to give you everything they got. You got to take my life before you take my job. I'm talking concrete commitment. I'm talking a commitment that says, I am going to stay true to what I said I would do long after the move that I've set it in has left. Because character is not something we inherit. Character is something we got to wake up every single day. We got to fight it. We got to build it. In the midst of adversity, in the midst of challenges, in the midst of failures, we got to get up every single day. We got to fight for peace. We got to fight for happiness. We got to fight for joy. Focus on how your life will be better and what your life will look like when you get what you want. You do this and your brain will think that by helping you get what you want, you're moving away from pain and towards pleasure. Greatness isn't achieved by that one massive thing you do. It's those tiny little consistent baby steps we take every single day that add up to achieving that goal. Amazing things happen when you believe you have something. Your brain actively goes out to make it happen. Believe that you can do it and work hard to get it and it's yours. All I need you to do is speak up and say, I expect to win. Declare that it's over, that yesterday was the last day that you were a loser. Like yesterday was the last day you expected to come up short. When you set out for a goal, expect it to happen. Expect to be successful. Expect it to be positive. If you can expect it, if you can wake up feeling like a winner, if you can wake up talking like a winner, if you can expect that everything you do will come out winning, I guarantee you, you never ever have to come up short again. It might be here two, three, four before you get your big win, but you could decide now, I'm gonna walk, talk, and be a different person. You decide that, you're the lead character in the story of your life. Everything has to do with you attending to it. Too many of you are playing with your business. If you make that shift, I'm going to win. We're gonna play to win now. We're not playing to play. We're not playing to see how we do. We're not playing for fun. Once you start getting some winning, you start changing. You talk different, you walk different. All of a sudden, this isn't the same damn human being. You can change you. You'd be surprised what a little winning would do. You'd be surprised how good you'd be if you just decide to win. Be number one in your office, number one in your region. And when you start stacking them up, your life can change. Download this video and audio by becoming a member at benlionelscott.com. Plus, get early access to all new content and...